Oke, okay. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello everyone. So today I'm going to create a an ID card repository with Strapi. So okay, this is the admin page that I have in Strapi. So first to configure the Strapi we have to we have to just type service mode status enable to make sure that in order to make sure that the MongoDB is running in the background so we can configure the strapi with mongodb because uh, if we use like quick start for example yarn create strapi dash app id dash card dash repository dash dash quick start so it will configure the database management system to SQLite so uh, I don't want that I don't want that and I I want to custom my installation to Mongo so I will just so this is how I run the uh, strappy um, actually to create the strappy strappy app named ID card repository and then I will be prompt to choose installation type and then click customs and then for the database client I will select Mongo and for this configuration I just followed the strappy documentation which requires MongoDB to be installed locally I'm using Ubuntu for, so if you are if you have not installed MongoDB yet you can follow these steps or if you are using Mac or Windows you can just follow the steps here and then I have just set the configuration like this and I left the username password and authentication database to blank just I left it blank and and then my application was created successfully in this path Uh, here ID dash card dash repository and then we will look at the folder ID card repository just click on the build I'm sorry config then go to the database.js to make sure that we have set database client to mongo as it says the connector is mongos okay then next I will open the application by changing the directory and then type yarn develop and here after logging in I have this dashboard so here is the actual dashboard which I have created a collection type named ID card repository currently I have no users and entry entries in ID card repository so if I I mean I have created ID card repository that 
consists of 13 fields which are namely Anika, name, birthplace, birth date, sex, blood type, address, religion, marriage, marriage status, occupation, nationality, expired date, and picture. I mean, these are some fields inside the national ID card or which is say which is called KTP in Indonesia. So I have the schema here. Actually, this is a bit different if we compare to the fields here. But I have uh, created schema and the fields I created here are, are configured based on this schema, especially the data type. For example, Anika, which, uh, which indicates the number, unique number or identifier of a person um, maybe I should have set this to integer oops Here we are. For any car consists of number, so it, it is integer for a name. Um, I'm going to search for the actual example. So a lot of katep here. Maybe I can open this one. Okay. I just make this uh, make the tab uh, smaller. So as you see, any car consists of numbers, which I set the data type integer and name is string. Birthplace is the tempat lahir here, uh, which is string also. I mean, mainly the data types used are string, but for example, like birth date, we need date here. So the data type is set to date and then sex, or it is called genus kelamin in Indonesia. Um, I, I set the data type to string, but I mean, we have on, we only have two options, which are laki laki and perempuan. Laki laki is male and perempuan is female. So I have set the enum on uh, several fields as the options are uh, limited. For for example, um, I cannot set the sex to for example, ABC because it is it, it doesn't make sense. And same goes same thing goes to blood type, marriage status, nationality, and etc. And for the address column, I mean for the address, it has several uh, several um, data inside for example RT RW uh, Desa Kecamatan which are um, I can say specific uh, data in address in Indonesia in Indonesian address and then I configured the data type of religion to string Occupation is also string. Nationality, there there is only there are only two nationalities, which are Weni or Wena, which which is Weni is Indonesian and Wena is people uh, who holds national uh, who holds nationality 
nationalities other than Indonesian. For expire date, I have set to date. And the picture, I have I have three um, data here, which are first profile picture, the picture inside the KTP, and the card picture. The card picture itself is uh, this um, a single card picture of this single card and with person picture means a picture um, a picture of a person who a picture of a person who uh, a picture of a person holding the uh, KTP or the identity card so I have three pictures here and then it should province city and date um, we cannot see here but actually for example if it is uh, published or I mean issued in Jakarta uh, this will be written on the uh, top of the identity card which says Provinsi DKI Jakarta Kota Jakarta Selatan that is just an example so this is the schema I will save this and yes um, these fields oops I'm sorry these fields are um, made based on this schema so this that is about content type and then we will use GraphQL I will use GraphQL in this uh, application so go to marketplace tab and check for the GraphQL plugin and make sure the plugin the GraphQL plugin is installed and I have this installed and go to roles and permission tab and I will just add new role I have added the new a new role called manager and for authenticated user I allow them to uh, do these six, these six uh, actions except delete and they are also allowed to upload same things uh, goes to go to manager role and for public role currently I have not set I have not said anything yet because the this is ID card repository in and it is just dangerous uh, to be able to to seen by public even is even if just fine action so I will not allow this public role to conduct any action currently So uh, currently I have not any entries. I don't have any entries in these content collection types. Maybe I will add it right later. Thank you very much for watching. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.